Hi, I'm Rena Porter Waylow. And I'm Learning Reporter Trinity. Welcome to this all, special All Blacks edition of RVP TV. We've been learning about persuasive writing and used our skills to enter a competition to win a visit from the All Blacks. <laughs> our entry was a music video adapted back from the song Don't Stop Believing by the band Journey. We rewrote the lyrics to our head of rugby team, then created a video that told a story about All Blacks fans travelling to the Rugby World Cup in London. Our class band took home our tour, played all the instruments, and we were supported by our music teachers. Kaius was on the drums, Tom and Dylan were on the guitar, and Ashley was on the piano. Backing vocals were supplied by Chloe, Maya, Ailey, and Lexi. Amelia was our lead singer. Our teacher, Mr. Joyce, helped us produce the movie using iMovie, then submitted it to the All Blacks to the Nation competition. In we waited impatiently to see if we won. Then, on Tuesday the 18th of August, Mr. J came back from a training course. And he had told us that we had won. We went absolutely crazy. And that brings us to today. It is the 3rd of September. We have some All Blacks here in Room 13's Learning Studio. We would like to thank Sunny, Tony and Aaron for coming in and letting us interview. Hi, I'm Lily. Being an All Black is such an honour, but if you could choose another career, what would it be? Here you go, Lily. Um... I think if I could choose another career, um, I'm not too sure. That's not been over. Boys, good question. Yeah, um, if I was a rugby player, I'd be a farmer, so that's what I'm going to do. Yep, uh, if I wasn't a rugby player, I'd love to play golf. So it'd be, well, if I can't play golf, then I would come be a farmer with you. I'll be a part too. We'll help out our time. Thanks. We are lucky at Longbow Primary to have such dedicated teachers. Was there a teacher that made a lasting impression? This is a long time ago for me. Um, Mr. King, he was my uh, third form um, teacher. And uh, yeah, he was pretty strict on us, but he was a good teacher as well. So yeah, Mr. King. Um, mine would be Mrs. Kayo. She was a um, pretty tough teacher at Liver Street School. I was a bit of a naughty kid, and she uh, bent me into shape, which was good. But um, she was very fair. So if we were really good, we got to go out and play sport or play music or like a treat at the end of the day. So she was cool. Um, Mr. Kurt Taylor. I think, um, just like Aaron, like, out on you, but, um, you get out and play footy and have fun, so. Thank you. Hi, I'm Kyra. The Haka is such a big part of the All Blacks tradition. Can you please tell us what the new Kapa Opanga Haka represents? There you go, Kyra. Um, I think we better leave it to Woody to, um, speak about it, seeing as he's been in the All Blacks the longest, so. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, this, the new huck is written um, by a guy named Derek Lavelli. He's the man. Uh, he wrote the hucker for the All Blacks, and um, it's for the players, and just makes it more connected as a, only the All Blacks can do it. So, Kamati, a lot of people do it as a hucker for New Zealand, but a um, couple of pummel is just for us, and it's very special, and uh, the words are pretty much just for us. Kia ora. Who was the first person you thought of when you were named in a World Cup squad? Uh, my family. I mean, um, my family and my close ones because I knew they would be proud of me. Um, yeah, probably uh, wife and kids. See, I'm going to be away for a while, so that's one of the things I thought of. Um, same as Sunny. My mum and dad made sure I rang them straight away. Told them to keep it a secret though, we found out pretty early in the morning. So they had to, my mum's not very good at keeping secrets, so it's a bit of a rush, but it was alright. Hi, I'm David. 
What did you think of our music video, Don't Stop Believing? Yeah, I thought uh, your music video, Don't Stop Believing, was uh, really good. Like, um, would have liked a little bit more volume, but <laughs> it's okay. I'm sure we can fix it. Uh, mate, it was really cool. I liked, uh, I liked how it was played by you, sung by you, and then there was all the action clips, all the photos of the stadiums. Like that's a lot. Took would have taken a lot of time, and it was very cool, mate. And, um, you can see why he's won. Yeah, um, David, you can see why you guys won. A lot of effort, but um, it was awesome to watch. And uh, your lead singer, you put your hand up, you're the lead singer. Oh, you got an awesome voice, love. So. Thank you. Um, but yeah, uh, all of you's put. Um, Put together a great clip, so congratulations. Oh, what was your most embarrassing moment as a professional you were Well, we have a few One of them was probably this, would have been this year. Uh, we played against the Crusaders and I got stepped and I fell over. They keep running, so that wasn't too good. Um, just embarrassing when you make mistakes, pretty much. Um, mine was this year as well. We were playing the Crusaders, and our first five eight Lima got Simbin, and I'd take a shot for goal, and it was ugly. It was like pang. So yeah, if I could have that back, I would love to. But everyone keeps reminding me, don't worry about goal kicking. So yeah. Thank you for coming to Northway Primary School. We wish you all the best for the Rugby World Cup. We are proud of you and we believe you can win the World Cup. We would like to send you away with a fuckatoki. Bye, er, kwe. Ke te iti kauhuri rangi. Ke te tahu, kwe. Me maunga teite. Seek the treasure most value dearly. If you bow, bow your head, let it be to a lofty mountain. Thank you, Wailong, and to our heroes, Sunny, Tony, and Aaron. We hope you like this special All Blacks edition of LPT. Kaki Tiaro.